hey guys welcome back so guys in this video we are going to do about image crud continuation which is how to validate the image for example like if we are taking a file that time if you take a png file jpg file jpg file that time it should accept the image if you are taking pdf dox that time it should not take the images right file so while adding for example now if you add right now if you add a pdf also it will go and save into your folder for example if i add this open and save it that time it will go and save off right but we want to validate this thing so for that guys let us get back and start with the coding so we have already done all this coding guys so it's a continuation of it part e for this to validate the image only okay so guys let's get back to our coding and let's go to the page called faculty.php file so the faculty.php file is here open and then the model what you are calling over here when you click on add add faculty is over here so let's go into our model so it is on the top so here is the model guys this is the add faculty and the forms are this right so when you click on faculty save faculty copy this and you are going to action code.php let's go to code.php and search the control f v so you are getting the code over here okay so this is the button where you are going to set it for the saving it right so guys now we will put a condition that it should only accept uh, the images pics okay not the documents or files so guys let's give start the coding okay so we'll give a validate image mm, file okay we are creating a variable and then yeah not file we will give extension it is actually okay we are extend extension we are checking it so guys there are two methods that we can check the extension so first method i will show you directly so let us copy this and call this over here make sure this is nothing but your input file okay so this is my image input tag where i am choosing the image so copy this name attribute data and paste it over here okay and instead of name you have to give us type so this type will accept as a extension over there okay so guys let us type and into double quotes give image forward slash jpg then you have to check with another one so let's use or operator double pipeline and then same you are going to copy it okay so let us copy this copy paste and paste so these two things are set and remove the last pipeline that is okay pipe symbol not pipeline sorry for it okay guys so we will call the png and last we will call jpeg so these three types should be accepting it so guys uh, this now while validating you have to put a if condition if this file exists then do the coding insert else ignore it right so guys for that we will give a simple if condition if it's correct execute the code else let's see else you have to say that it is wrong okay so guys you can just copy this status same thing and paste now so over here we will show as message as only like o n l y only p n g j p g and jpeg images are allowed okay allowed done 
if it is not allowed i mean when it is correct that time it should execute so guys for that we will paste this first variable into our if statement and set it over here simple so make sure you are not getting confused with the type you have to make it type not the name okay name means it will take the correct name whatever you are choosing with it type means it will take the type so guys now this cut this and put at the last of this if statement okay so i will just close and show you guys there should be no confusion simple let me move it forward yeah guys so this is the thing guys and now let us test for this and check the output so this is one method i'm teaching you so second method i'll just tell you within after testing this so let's reload the page so once it's loaded let us click on add and let's type some unwanted data and let's upload the image not image we will upload a pdf file okay so when we click a pdf file and let's open it so dot pdf is there let me save this it should give me an error okay here guys only png jpg and jpeg images are allowed right if i give any of this three image then it will tell me correct thing okay so you can just give and let us add the image so guys i'll add as fav icon new with the logo and here name is with prakash okay let's save this dot png and uh, faculty added so guys you can see at the last with prakash with the logo it's updated okay so guys we have successfully done that how to uh, validate this extension or a uh, image only it should be accepting it so guys, this was the one method which is lengthy or little so we will i'll tell you one more method that we can use it so i just copy the same variable copy control c and control v over here we will use this later first we'll create a image img types okay so what are the extensions we'll create in array format so you are going to create an array inside that you will give img slash jpg then give comma again img forward slash jpg not jpg png and then the final one more thing that is image forward slash jpeg set this and let's break this into we are getting the data in this image types so we are going to use in one extension in array format in underscore array function over here you will paste okay so before this paste where you are going to divide is that just give a comma and call your extension that is your input tag input of file let's paste that type over here so this is the another solution this is very shortcut solution like not not lengthier or extended too much so this is a very simple and shortcut way so guys i will just then call this same variable into if condition so let me comment this that it should not work with this and we will try with this extension and let's see it's working fine oops there is one alter okay so just change this and let's save and try once again with the new one again i'm going to upload the pdf file so let's click on it type unwanted data and then let's try to add pdf or any other document so let's add pdf open and let's save what is the error only png jpg jpg images are allowed so guys we have done in the second method also so guys now we have completed it successfully and now for this same thing you are going to update with the edit and update also okay 
so like when you are going to click on edit that time also if you upload any other image like pdf and then update that so you should give here also the condition that it should not update the other file only images so guys that also we will set it in this image so if you are getting confused please watch out the image crud of faculty my series in link into description okay so let's go to faculty edit.php file i mean to set this file which we are right now and then let's get back so when we are giving a uh, faculty update button we are clicking we are going to code.php so let's go to code.php and control f and search so guys the button is over here the same method we are going to apply for this okay for updating one till here okay so guys before that i will just show you how we can set this so simple i am going to copy the same thing if statement and else also you have to copy so before searching when you click on update that time only it should get updated right so for that let's paste this if condition very simple format so no confusion and let's paste the else also copy let's move this little forward and type and paste okay so we have given the condition over here also and let us save this and update once again let's get back let me cancel this and let me edit once again let's get over here and edit so once you click on edit i am going to upload the pdf not the original one so let's update the pdf open and click on update so you will get a error called only jpg png formats are allowed cool so guys um you can tell a uh, different message also like over here allowed try updating again that's it for this update one i'm just giving there should be no confusion so guys um successfully we have completed that how to validate the png jpg jpg images only to accept in the your image crud so guys thank you for watching this video please subscribe like and share